Hey YouTube, um, it's Feech back with another video. Just wanted to um, make a short video about how to take your Valentine 1 radar detector out of Europe mode. I've, um, I actually figured this out by myself. I, um, I bought this radar off eBay. Of course it was used, but, um, latest firmware. The website was sold now because it's a very popular radar for race car drivers or people that in general that like to speed so um i got this and it was in europe mode so after playing around with it i figured out how to take off europe mode right now i put back into europe mode to show you guys how to um assess the problem so um, i'll be showing you guys in this quick video right now as you see it's in europe mode like big U, small U. Um uh, big U and small U I figured out just me is basically like little L and big L if you are in US. Small U and big U is for Europe. Um I could drive like this in the US and it would function the same way. But because I'm in the US and I wanted to make my radar um uh, make my radar like US friendly I, I'm i not sure if this will um give me more uh, phones alerts or not but I just wanted to make sure so um yeah so we're in Europe mode you wanna uh, press and hold the button while I'm turning it off Okay, now you let go of the button. The radar is completely off. You Now you want to press and hold it while you're turning on the radar. So you see it's press and hold. When all the lights turn on, you see it's on. Um, you see the radar. Is, now it's in programming mode. I can make a video about how to program your radar if you are really interested or you can google it. Um, it's up to you, just leave me a comment if you do want me to show you how to program this. So right now we're in programming mode. If you press a button it will go through like cycle and show you your, um, uh, your, your software version, mine's 3.8.26. Um, 3.826, I mean, not 8.26. Sorry about that. So, now you press it. It's, um, you go through programming mode. Once you get on the way to the end, there should be a U. And then you see how the U is down. We want that arrow to be up. So, you just press and hold it. Now the arrow is up. Now you just want to turn it off, and now when you turn on the radar, it should be in the US mode. Turn it on, and we'll cycle through. Uh, well, usually it goes A, L, and L, but I'm not sure why. So you see it's on small L, we can go to big L right now, or we can go to A. I can, um, if you guys want to know more about those settings um just uh message me in the comments and i'll make a video about those settings but yeah so i've had this radar in the past i did sell it because it wasn't like up to my standards when i first got into radars i thought oh if you see a police it automatically uh tells you there's a police um which I was false. Later on when I grew up and actually became wiser, I figured out that radars only detect police if they got radars on. So you got to do your research and look around or else you're getting a ticket. So, um, yeah. So this radar, so far so good. I've seen a few police. Of course they didn't have their radars on. It didn't go off. Coming home today, uh, basically, 
all of the cop cars except maybe like three cop cars had that radars on it, and this thing was alerting like full strength on KA band which in my state they usually use KA band some states also use K um I know that some cop vehicles where I do live also use K so um yeah, K is one of them, but KA is the majority of the alerts. Um, so I got this radar because I'm moving, and to the state I'm moving, there is a lot of cops, so hopefully it works. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. And, um, in my car, I'm gonna be doing this carbon fiber on the trim carbon fiber so it's gonna look very nice um i'll update you guys on that in the next video um see you guys then